Tomorrow at 11 a.m., Tourism New Zealand to highlight its latest product offerings at exclusively curated webinar for the Indian travel trade. Sterling Holidays launch a wildlife resort in Pench National Park. UP aims to strengthen its air connectivity to help enhance tourism in the state. Ayodhya International Airport is coming up very fast. Kushinagar International Airport already we have started. Uh, Zewar International Airport is uh, under construction and uh, so many other places uh, which we had earlier uh, air strips. So we are converting into domestic airports also. Before 2024, Ayodhya Airport will be uh, functional. In fact, uh, land acquisition process has already been completed and construction work is in full swing. IATO President Rajiv Mera highlights the current challenges for inbound operators. The domestic market and the wedding market uh, is spoiling the inbound tourism at the moment. Why I'm saying it's spoiling is that domestic market uh, came back in with a big boom, which made hoteliers increase their rates. The the weddings, which used to go abroad, are all happening in India. So that will continue, I think, for another two three months. And then um, I think uh, the domestic market people will start traveling abroad. Weddings will start going abroad. So things will balance down. Uh, and we should come down to some uh, good rates which the foreign tourists can attract. Because our problem is that if the rates are very high in India, people are trending to go to Sri Lanka, Bali, Singapore, Thailand. So that's the way we are... We are uh, what the challenges what we are facing and visa is another problem especially from UK, Canada, Malaysia and some of the Middle East countries. That need to be sorted out. So there are multiple problems which need to be sorted out and once they are sorted out we should get business.